Hello everyone, welcome to the online class. Myself, Daryl Gifty Manisha, working as Temporary Assistant Professor in Government College of Engineering, Chennai. Through this video, we are going to learn about XML scan. XMAS refers to an advanced port scanning technique known as XMAS scan. The name XMAS is derived from the abbreviation of the different flag sets in the TCP packet, resembling the type of the port scan used to identify open, closed, or filtered ports on your target system. It involves sending TCP packets with specific flag combinations to target ports and analyzing the responses received. For each scan, the scanning tool sends a TCP packet with a flag set and without any other flag such as synchronize or acknowledgement. The target system responds to the packet in different ways providing information about the status of the port. If the port is open and receiving packets, the target system typically sends no response. This behavior indicates that the port is open and the packet has been silently discarded. If the port is closed, the target system typically responds with the TCP reset packet, this response indicates that the port is closed and the reset packet terminates the connection button. If the port is filtered or blocked by a firewall, the target system may respond with the ICMP unreachable message or no response at all. These responses indicate that the port is filtered and the scanning tool cannot determine the state of the port. By analyzing the responses received, an XML scan can help identify the open, closed or filtered ports on a target system. This information is valuable for security assessments identifying potential vulnerabilities and understanding the network topology. The flags used in an XML scan are urgent, push and pin flags. If the port is open, there is no response, but if the port is closed, the target responds with a reset acknowledgement packet XML scans work only on the target systems that follow the implementation of TCP IP and do not work against any version of Windows. XML scan can be detected by intrusion reduction systems or firewalls as they exhibit abnormal or suspicious behavior. As a result, XML scans are typically used by security professionals or ethical hackers who are authorized to perform network assessments and penetration tests. Using XML scan without proper authorization is considered unauthorized and potentially illegal. Next, in an XML scan, the responses from target system can indicate different port states. Here are the common port states observed in XML scan. First one is open filtered. If a port is open and receiving packets, the target system typically does not respond to an XML scan. This behavior is known as silent discarding and indicates that the port is open and actively accepting connections. Next, closed. Closed port. If the port is closed, the target system usually responds with a TCP reset packet in response to the XML scan. The reset packet signifies that the port is closed 
and terminates the connection attempt. The closed port state indicates that the port is not actively accepting connections. Next, the last one is filtered port. If a port is filtered or blocked by a firewall, the target system may respond in various ways or not respond at all. In the case of an XMAS, the target system may respond with an ICMP unreachable message or simply drop the XMAS scan packet without any response. These response or lack thereof indicate that the port is likely filtered or blocked by a firewall or other network security measures. It's important to note that port states observed in an XML scan are not definitive and can be influenced by various factors including network configurations, firewalls and intrusion detection systems. Additionally, modern systems may employ techniques to mitigate response to port scans, making it more challenging to accurately determine the port state based on an XMAS scan. Therefore, it is recommended to use multiple scanning techniques and corroborate the result for a more accurate assessment of port states. Next, we are going to see about working of XMAS scan. An XMAS, XMAS scan is a port scanning technique used to determine the state of ports on a target system. In an XML scan, the TCP packet sent to the target has the flags as pin flag, push and urgent. By setting these flags, the sender is attempting to elicit specific responses from the target system. If a port is closed, the target should respond with a TCP reset packet. However, if a port is open, the target might respond differently, indicating its state. Here is how an XMAS scan works. A series of TCP packets is sent to a target system with the urgent push and pin flag set simultaneously. If the port is open and unfiltered, the target system should discard this packet because the combination of flags is unusual and not expected in the normal communication scenario. Next, if a port is closed, the target system typically responds with a TCP reset packet indicating that the port is closed and requested service is not available. Finally, if a port is filtered, it means that the firewall or other network filtering device is in place. The device may not respond to the packets at all, providing no clear um, indications of whether the port is open or closed. In XML scans are considered stealthy because they exploit certain behaviors of TCP stack implementations. However, many modern firewalls and intrusion reduction systems are capable of detecting and blocking XMAS scans, flagging them as suspicious or potentially malicious activity. Performing any form of network scanning or port scanning without proper authorization or in violation of applicable laws and regulations is illegal and unethical. It is essential to obtain appropriate permissions and adhere to legal and ethical guidance when conducting security assessments for network scanning activities. That's all about XMAS scan. Thank you for listening to the lecture.